all throughout the country that you see here. But uh, I wanted to show you some examples here. If you see right here, Maggie Valley, right there, if you can see that, Claude, what is the dollar amount from that acre of property, that one and a half acre they're selling for right now? $19,000. Yep, that's one there. Here's 1 1.4, 35,000, 1 1.6, 50,000. Five acres, 48. Here's another one, one and a half, 45,000. Okay. Here's another one, 47. So three lots, you guys, for $20,000. So do you think I could probably sell one of these lots for at least, let's just say even half of that for twenty or $30,000? Wow. That's, that's exactly it. And uh, it's something that you're able to go ahead and do. And just to show you really quick, we just now got an offer for one of the lots for 22000 one of them out of the three, and we paid 22000 for it. So just on this one property, we're now getting uh, our money back just in that one. So that just shows you an example uh, in regards as far as picking up fairly inexpensively and turning around and reselling the properties with that. Um, and what so was that, I, that web page again, Henry, to check valuation? Sure. Yeah, and great. It is called landwatch.com. Thank you right in here. So landwatch.com. And so that'll give you an idea anywhere within the country. It gives you an idea of what, what vacant land is, because that's always a key question. Now, Zillow is starting uh, to show a little bit, uh, you know, Zillow, it, it all depends. It's a hit and miss, but Zillow now is starting to do some of the things in, in regards with that. Um, one of the things I wanted to go ahead and show you, we talked about houses. Um, I actually marketed uh, to a vacant lot and ended up picking up, I mean, a very cheap, inexpensive house. Um, Really quick, you know, if you see this property right here, not the best looking house, you know, hardly anything at all. But I mean, Claude, what do you think you'd pay for this house right here? I'd pay you to take it off my hands. <laughs> 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 exactly. You, you know, and, and that's exactly it. The owner just wanted to get rid of it. That was their main thing. Um, one of the pictures, I mean, the kitchen's not too bad. This gives you an idea as far as the kitchen is concerned. Mm -hmm. um, you know, so it's, it's a three bedroom, two bath. A uh, little property. It's not the best, uh, but yeah, it would take a lot of rehab job. But I ended up picking up this property, um, if you see it right in here, for roughly including everything in there, twenty six hundred dollars. This house for twenty six hundred, um, and, and so turned around and actually how I sold this was to a neighbor who was looking for a place for their son to move next door to them. This is their house right in here in the background. I went ahead, sent a uh, letter to all the neighbors, ended up selling this house here real quickly for 15,000 cash. So like Claude was saying, you know, how'd you like to have, you know, 12 grand, you know, by Christmas. And so this was something here. Could I probably sold it more? Yes, I probably could have if I would have marketed and did everything else. But I just went ahead and just unloaded it fairly quickly for cash, closing within two weeks from that standpoint to be able to do it. And quick, so, inter a quick question, Henry. I love the marketing strategy you just stated, where yes. you, sent, you sent a letter, a postal letter, I presume, to all the owners in the neighborhood. Um, Correct. Is, is, uh, tell us, what, um, how, how effective is that? It is 